My dearly beloved brothers and sisters in Christ, I greet and bless you all in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. May the name of the Lord be glorified. On this day, June 4th, it is a great pleasure to meet you through this auspicious message. May the Lord bless you. Take with me from the book of Psalm 48:14, for this is God, our God forever and ever. He will be our guide even to death. My dear brothers and sisters, if you go after men who trust you, then they may desert you or deceive you. Many men make promises in the church on the day of marriage, saying, I will be with you in your good and bad times, when you are healthy or when your health is bad, when you are financially equipped or when you are not. At all times, I will be with you. They make such promises. But many men forget all their promises and desert their wives halfway. There are women who will desert their husbands, too. This is how the present time is passing by. In this situation, God is saying, He will be our guide even to death. So what we see is that He will be with us to the very end of our lives. He will travel with you in your good times and in your bad times. The Lord God, our Lord Jesus Christ, says, This is God who is forever and ever, and He will guide you to the very end of your life. That means the Lord will be with you always. Till your death, He will lead you in a wonderful manner. He will lead you in a marvelous manner. He will lead and guide you in a surprising way. He will lead you in a surprising way before all the people. He will feed you good food and lead you. He will protect you and guide you. He alone can lead you. How many of you are willing to be guided by Him? Then good things will happen in your life. Then a day will come when you will say, It is good that I have this Lord as my Lord. I am blessed to have this God as my God. God will make many great things in your life, such that they will be marvelous to your eyes. And surprising too. God says in Isaiah 58:11, The Lord will guide you continually. He who leads you until death will lead you each day of your life. He will satisfy your soul in a drought. So God will break all the barriers and do many good things for you. Dear Lord, we thank you. Lord, we offer millions of thanks and praises for guiding us to the very end of our lives. Lord, we believe in the presence of God, that we are blessed to have God as our Lord, and we confess it. Hereafter, may the hand that leads be with them. Let the hand of the Lord, who anoints and loves them, be with them. Lead them in a wondrous manner. Lead them to the very end. Lead them wonderfully. Do miracles for them and lead them. Protect them and lead them. Keep them away from sickness and disease. Let every barrier be broken apart. May they live a good and healthy life in all things. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, I greet and bless you all my dearly cherished brothers and sisters in Christ. May God be praised for His name. It is a tremendous joy to meet you through this auspicious message on this auspicious June 4th. God bless you. I would like you to consider Psalm 48:14, which says, For this is God, God of our eternal salvation. Even in death, He will serve as our leader. Greetings, darling siblings. Men who trust you might cheat on you or forsake you if you pursue them. On their wedding day, many men pledge in church that they will support their spouse through both good and bad times. Moments, whether your health is good or poor, and whether you have adequate money or not. I will be by your side, no matter what. They say things like that. However, a lot of men break their vows and leave their wives in the middle. There are also wives who will walk out on their spouses. The current era is evaporating in this manner. God is declaring, He will be our guide even to death in this circumstance. It is evident that He will be by our sides till the very end of our days. He will accompany you on your journey through both good and difficult times. Our Lord Jesus Christ, the Almighty, declares, This is God who is eternal and ever and He will lead you all the way to the conclusion of your existence. Thus, the Lord will always be by your side. He will lead you in a marvelous way till the day of your death. He'll guide you in an amazing way. 
He'll lead and mentor you in an unexpected manner. He is going to lead you in a way that will surprise everyone. He will guide you and feed you well. He will watch out for you and lead you. You can only be led by him. How many of you are open to following his lead? After that, positive things will occur in your life. One day you will remark, it is good that I have this Lord as my Lord. I am fortunate to have this God for a God. God will work many wonderful things in your life, things that will appear magnificent to you. Not to mention unexpected. In Isaiah 58 11, God declares, the Lord will continually guide you. You will be led every day of your life by the one who guides you till death. When all else fails, he will satiate your spirit. God will therefore remove all obstacles and bless you greatly. We are grateful to you, Lord. We thank and praise you millions of times over, Lord, for leading us to the end of our lives. Lord, we acknowledge that you are present with us and that we are fortunate to have you as our Lord. From now on, may the hand proceed to accompany them. Let them be in the loving and anointing hand of the Lord. Lead them in a marvelous way. Take them all the way through. Lead them with grace. Lead them, work wonders for them. Lead them and keep them safe. Keep illnesses and diseases away from them. Let all barriers fall apart. I hope they lead a happy and healthy life in every way. We ask in the name of Jesus. Indeed.